Hey, let me show you something. Let me show you. Y'all can tell I wear the hell out of these shoes. If y'all see all them creases, I'll be goddamn. What's up, Guap Nation? It's your boy, Guapo, checking in here today for my Guap Nation fam on the channel. I want to bring y'all a different type of video. Now, the year is wrapping up. 2019 is in its last day. So I thought, why not, since it's coming to the end of the year, why not talk about my top sneakers of 2019? And this is just pickup wise. I'm not talking about the top shoe to release because, of course, I didn't get every shoe that came out this year. These will be the top shoes that I feel like I picked up this year that I just, you know, wear the most or just like the most. So we're going to get into the video. We're not going to waste no more time. You're going to see a lot of heat. So make sure you get ready. Get your sunscreen ready because there's a lot of heat coming and let's just get it. All right, so shoe number one, and I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all can agree with me. This is actually the shoe that made me like Jordans to begin with. So y'all don't know, these just dropped. I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all got them. But the Jordan 11 Breads 2019, I'm gonna go ahead and take one shoe out for y'all. And yeah, this is definitely my number one shoe. Number one all day. And as y'all can see, I have been wearing them. Y'all can tell the bottoms are dirty. I'm not one of those sneakerheads that just get the shoe and just sit it in my closet. I actually like to wear my shoes. So, you know, like I said, these are going to be shoes that I like the most or that I wear the most or both. So, Jordan Bread 11 is number one on the list. Yeah, y'all good look at that. Yeah, they still in good condition, but the bottoms are a little dirty. But hey, what can you do when you wear your shoes? Let's get to the next shoe. All right, now, shoe number two is actually a Jordan 1 that dropped, I want to say, like, two... Two months ago, two or three months ago, maybe a month ago. It was in the one to three months ago range, but the Jordan 1 Fearless, you already know. I don't know how many of y'all were able to get these, but these are definitely a cop for me. I've dressed these up to, I've turned a lot of heads with these, I'm not even gonna lie. This shoe is, if you can get it with the right outfit, it's definitely one to just, you know, to keep in your collection and just, like I said, the bottoms are a little dirty because I wear all my shoes. I know some of y'all probably mad at that, but you know, I, I buy shoes to wear them. So yeah, shoes still in pretty good condition. I wore it probably, I want to say six, seven times, but definitely if you can get the right outfit to go with these, people gonna be turning their heads like, boy, what the hell the bitch right there on your feet, boy, the hell? You know what I'm saying? So definitely number two shoe. This is my number two cop on the list. So yeah. Let's get to the next one. All right, so for my next shoe, y'all know I'm not gonna bring Jordans all the way the whole video because your boy is, is diverse, you know? We don't just stick with the Jade. So these, Nike Air Max 97, this is the Sunburst. This came out the Sunburst pack. This is one of three shoes that came with that pack. And I ain't gonna lie, y'all, I wear the hell out of these. <laughs> I ain't gonna... Hey, let me show you something, let me show you. Y'all can tell I wear the hell out of these shoes. If y'all see all them creases, I'll be goddamn. The point I'm trying to get at is I wear these shoes a lot. So let me give y'all a look. They're still in good condition. I keep all my shoes in good condition, but you can tell I wear these a lot just off the creases right here. So that's shoe number three for me. And now let's get to the next one. All right, so for my next shoe, like I said, your boy gotta switch it up. I can't just come with the Jordans and the Nikes the whole video. So we have the Yeezy 350 cloud whites right here. And yes, I honestly feel like this is one of the most fire colorways to drop for this year. The cloud whites, it, it was different. It was different. Y'all can tell, I do wear these bad boys, judging by the bottom. Y'all see that, ooh, ooh. Y'all know I done put in some work with these shoes right here, but definitely the cloud whites. And not only do I like them because I wear them a lot and they look cool, but it's also, I got these by luck. I got these out of raffle that I thought I wasn't gonna win. All the odds look like they were against me and just out of the grace of God, I got the shoe at the end of the day. So definitely, I love these because I wear them. They look good and they got a backstory to it. So, you know, this is shoe number four for me. Definitely, like I said, I wear them. I'm mad they don't have a pull tab, but hey, what can you do? I don't work for Adidas Yeezy, whatever. We just gonna get on to the next shoe. All right, so for the next shoe, this shoe was definitely a hit when it dropped. Everybody was going crazy over it. I feel like, I think it sold, I know here, I can't speak for everywhere, but here it sold out same day. But the Nike Air Max 97, ooh, I had the box the wrong way. The have a Nike Days, y'all know. Let me just 
take it out real quick. I was wasting time with the box. When I should be wasting time with the well, it won't be wasting. Anyways, the 97 have a Nike days. Now I'm not even gonna lie, these kinda these kinda go with this shirt though. Hey, look at this. Oh no, no, your boy be fresh. I don't even be trying. I don't even be trying. Hey, I don't even be trying, but your boy fresh. Hey, hey, I do this. I do it. I do it. I do it. But anyways, Air Max 97 have a Nike days. These definitely, I wear the hell out of these. Like I actually got some paper from the box right there. That's what I actually had. But now I actually, at some point, I was wearing them so much to the point where I had to like actually clean them a couple of times. So, as y'all can see, they still got little dirt stains on them and stuff like that. Shoe is still in good condition, but I do wear the hell out of these. I, I will I will stamp that. I wear these faithfully. These are one of my favorite 97s to drop this year. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. And just the, the way they design, the, designed it, just... Let's go on to the next shoe, because I can do a full video about this shoe right here. So Now, this next shoe actually didn't release in 2019, but I picked it up in 2019, and I have to say... I probably spent the most money on these out of any pickup this year, which is, y'all know what's going on, 350s, breads. So these definitely will be an honorable mention. I don't know what happened to the box, to be honest. I got to find it somewhere in here, but yeah, these definitely, they were lit. They definitely um, didn't drop in 2019, so they're not a top sneaker of 2019, but honorable mention so we'll throw those in there and i appreciate y'all for tuning in each and every video go out make sure without y'all would not be one today so i want to say thank you thank you yes you for watching this video tell your auntie your uncle your lizard your cat and your dog subscribe to go out make sure because we're going bigger and stronger each and every day and i appreciate y'all for supporting we have more bangers coming soon so y'all can stay tuned and until next time we are